Well, good morning, everybody. I'm back out at it again today. Little fall has finally made it to Texas. It's 45 degrees out this morning. Woohoo! I'm so excited. So tired of being hot. Anyways, I made the drive out to a little bit west here, a couple of hours to some farm permissions I have. I'm gonna hunt this one here today. You can see that old pecan tree there. That detector's leaning up against how big it is. <laughs> that thing is humongous for a pecan tree. Anyways, this place was started back in the 20s. We're gonna see if we can find anything up here interesting. And I'll get back to you on the first interesting signal. 21, 22. Unlike most old farms, plenty of iron around. I'm trying to run it wide open, but whew, there's a lot of iron here. We got it, whatever it is. Well, we got some kind of coin. <laughs> we got a token to start out with. A CC's pizza token. <laughs> we'll start with a token, that'll work. Keep going. I had one here coming up in iron, like a bunch of it. Not quite sure what that is, but it looks like a little buckle of some sort. Let's keep looking. Twenty-six, seven, eight. Sounds fairly deep. Yep, gonna be a little deeper. Definitely a lot deeper. Check it out. Check it out. I see it. Got a mercury dime. Awesome. Barely could hear it. Down there in that sand. Probably. Six, seven inches deep. Sweet. Keep looking. Here's the next one. Anywhere from 30 to 34. Oh, that's going to be deeper too. Whoa. These rocks are something big down there. I think we might have got a silver quarter. Nineteen fifty-two. 
We got a silver quarter. Ha ha ha. Big silver. Awesome. That's it in that hole. I'll swing back over when I get back up. Awesome. Well, I had one here kind of jumping around in iron and going up to about 16, 17, 18. And check that out. Got a set of points. Or part of it anyways. <laughs> That's cool. Had one of those in a long time. Let's keep it looking. Just a solid 21, about two foot from where I found that little set of points. Let's see what this one is. I think I seen it. There it is. Penny. Haha, <laughs> wheat scent. Got a weedy. Oh, 1940 something maybe. Hard to tell at the moment. It's definitely a wheat scent. Keep it looking. Only 930. Not very deep. Probably gonna be a clad core, but let's dig it and see. I think I see it right there. Yep, that was just gonna be a clad quarter. Let's keep looking. Anywhere from 18 to 22 or 3. Ah, not very deep. A shotgun shell head stem. Go clean her up and see what it is. It's 12 gauge. I can't read the rest of it at the moment. We'll get a look at it later. Twenty-seven to thirty-one. Not a good solid signal, but a high tone. Let's see what this one is. There it is. We got another Merker dime. <laughs> Not a lot of signals out here, but some good ones. Whew, can't make out the date on that one. That was almost turned black. Second Merker dime for the day. Keep looking.
couple of targets here. Sorry if you hear some rumbling in the background. Somebody cranked up a big piece of machinery over there somewhere. Got that one there. 2627. And a solid 17 there. Let's see what this one is first. In there somewhere. There it is. Ah, oh, we got a weedy. Nineteen, another nineteen forty something. Let's see what that is. I see it. And another shotgun shell head stamp. Sweet. Let's keep looking. Twenty four, twenty five, twenty six. In there somewhere. Missed it a little bit. Still in there. There it is. A weedy down there hiding. A green one. Another wheat scent for today. Let's keep going. Pretty much a solid 18. Let's see what it is. Ooh, easy now. Make sure I didn't chunk it over there. It's still there somewhere. <laughs> well, that was zipper pull looks like. <laughs> Let's keep well, I have one here coming in as iron. And I decided to dig it and check out what it is. That is a spur. Well, that's cool. Got a little piece of the wheel left on it. That is awesome. Let's keep looking. Well, he found another good signal. Anywhere 
from 2425 up to 2930. Gonna be deeper. There it is. Check out that silver looking rim. Gonna be a mercury dime. <laughs> awesome. We got three mercury dimes a day. Let's keep going. Twenty four, twenty five, twenty six. See what that is. A uh, penny. Another green weedy. <laughs> cool. Do a little bit longer before we got to get out of here. I got to come back sometime. Bring my big coal. Keep looking. Another one coming up in iron. Check that out. Got a pair of scissors. <laughs> Let's keep going. There's one. Coming in 32, 39, 34. I was working my way back towards the truck. I'm back up here close to that open con tree. Let's see what this one is before we get out of here. Ah, oh, quit pulling it back in the hole. Still down there. Still, still down there. What in the world is that? Some kind of token? Can't really tell. Hmm. Good grief. That looks like it's got Lady Liberty on the front of it. There's Liberty all around it. One ounce. That's a one ounce silver round. <laughs> Can you believe that? Hey, 
This landowner's not gonna believe it when I show him that. Nine, 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 fine. That is amazing. How in the world did that get out here? That's just about the biggest silver you can find as far as coins go. Wow. <laughs> what a way to wrap up the day. A whole ounce of silver. Whew, I gotta go around this pecan tree a little bit longer before I go. That is too awesome. I don't know if I forget anything else before I call it a day. Hey everybody, going to do a wrap up for today's hunt. It finally cooled off here in Texas and I headed out a couple hours out west to some old farm permissions I got out there. Had a really fun day out there finding old coins. We'll start up here with some of the other junk I found. Found a pair of scissors. <laughs> What's left of some type of buckle, I'm not sure what type. And brass knob off of something, some old washers and there's an old square nail. You can see all the other garbage up there. Got very little clad. I got one quarter, two nickels and I think four pennies. Got a couple of shotgun shell head stamps. Still haven't quite got them cleaned up enough to tell what they are. I think that one says Peter's on it. And I got a CC's pizza token. And I really like this find here. That's actually an old spur. You can still see part of the star up there on the end of it. That's really cool. And an old set of copper points. And then for the old coins, I wind up getting four Wheaties. This one here is a 1940 something, I'm not sure what. And then I got a 41, and I believe that's a 44, and a 51. Those three are in decent shape. And I got some old silver coins today. I got one, I'm getting three mercury dimes. That one's a 42, that one's a 44, and that one's a 44. You gotta love finding them mercury dimes. I got me one silver quarter today in 1952. And then we got this here. I was working, working my way back towards the truck by that old big pecan tree where I started out. And I thought I'd found something I'd been hunting this whole time. Been metal detecting 11 years wanting to find one of these and a gold coin. I thought that was a silver round. And it's made just like it. I thought it just dark from being in the ground so long. And I got to notice and I nicked it right there on the eagle. And it looks like copper. And I got it cleaned off down at the bottom. It says one ounce copper. <laughs> Man, talk about a letdown. Still a fun find, but I thought I'd found a silver round. Anyways, it was still fun, like I said. Anyways, I hope y'all enjoyed the hunt. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you at the next.